every year the students vote to pick a teacher they believe will give them the best advice for the future here at graduation. She has been The word graduation comes from the word gratis, which means step. And this is a step for all of you into another life. What I want you to think about is this. Who you are and what you do begins right now. Aaron, I mean, Evan said you wanted some advice, so now you're stuck with it. Here are my 10 steps to a happy life. Number one, the content of your character is your choice. You have had a lot of role models at Liberty and at home. You all know the right thing to do, so do it. Number two, don't let your self-esteem depend on others' perception of you. Be your own compass for who you are. You each have your own journey. Don't let anyone take that from you. Number three, live longer with humor. The research says that people who can see the humor in life live longer. But be careful with humor. Use it as a tool, not as a weapon. Number four, talk to someone whose ideas do not agree with yours. Neuroscience studies show that brain function improves when you do this. And I'm convinced that if we talk to each other more, our problems would be less. Number five, don't be a jerk. <laughs> Your reputation is who you are. College is like a small town, and believe me, what you do and say will get around. Number six, never hit reply all. <laughs> that button on the computer is not your friend. Number eight is about parents. It's hard to understand the gift your parents are going to give you if they are paying for your schooling. Be appreciative. For many of you, your parents will become some of your best friends. You will probably be poor at school. But if you were very lucky and have been good, when your parents come to visit, they will take you to the grocery store and it will be amazing. <laughs> and for those of you who are paying your own way through school, you are to be admired and will be a step ahead. Number nine, this dating advice comes from my daughter as a cougar. Not a cougar, cougar, a WSU student cougar. <laughs> Just be yourself, cheesy lines will not work. Girls, don't fall for cheesy lines. And girls, do not spray your pillow with your boyfriend's cologne from home, it will make your roommate mad. And guys, inside out underwear does not mean clean undies. And finally, number 10. Mark Twain said something I've tried to live by, and I hope you do too. 20 years from now, you will be more disappointed by the things you did not do than by the things you did do. So throw off the bow lines, sail away from safe harbor, catch the trade wind in your sails, explore, dream, and discover. Thank you very much, class of 2010, you've been terrific. Been a long time. Class, graduating class of 2010, turn your tassels.
<laughs> wow. <I'm> Star Wars. <laughs> Woohoo!